Christy here. Thank you so much for joining me. In today's video, I have my more uh, April update <laughs> for hashtag that's expensive project man. This was a project created by me. Um, I we did it from December 20 to December 2021, and then we made it a fantastic ladies club. We started December 27th, 2020, or December 28th. December 28th, 2021, and we're going through December 27th of 2022. The premise is pick the most expensive products in your own personal collection and pan them. So eight to 10 items, you can do rolling or not rolling, set your own goals. I like to leave my projects open-ended, that way you can pan the way that you need to pan. So, hi. <laughs> I didn't think I had anything to update you guys on today, but then I pulled everything out and I'm like, no, I'm actually doing pretty good. So uh, let's start with the one empty this week, and that is this. This is the Rare Beauty Primer, Illuminating Primer. I mentioned how this had gone off, and yes, Deb, I make Rob smell everything. <laughs> so it's not just me sniffing, but I can definitely tell when something has gone off. That crate, like that root, blah, 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 old crayon, fake crayon smell is awful. This was okay, but like I mentioned, it had gone off. So I am glad to have this finished. I ended up finishing it by adding it with some hand cream, um, and I would use it on my hands. And you could probably kind of tell because they're a little bit glittery. But it's not one I would repurchase either. But it's done, and hallelujah for that. I ended up using that 28 times. Um, the next one that looks empty is this. This is the Rare Beauty Illuminator. If you saw my picture where I was splattered, um, <laughs> that looked inappropriate. It was actually this. I went to get the stopper out. It got all over my face and I poured this into that Franken Illuminator to lighten it up. It didn't. So this won't be done until that is considered done. I don't have that in here. I can throw up a picture, I think. Um, I have put that by my bed. So anytime I put lotion on, I squirt a little bit of that in my lotion and I put it on. And hopefully I can use it up that way. It's just too deep for my face. So this is still in the project. It's just an empty and I'm not able to measure it. But once this is done, once that is done, we'll consider this done too. Actually, once that is done, that'll be... <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six six illuminators six illuminators or liquid highlighters whatever you want to call them that's a lot <laughs> that's a lot uh and next we have my cargo eyeliner i'm still not done with this i have used this eight times since the last update for a total of 23 times there's not much left um i have it in my waterline today um i don't know how far this goes down but it needs to be sharpened um, it doesn't need to be sharpened yet, but it is a really deep, it's supposed to be plum. That's not very plum. So I will be glad to have this out of my collection. Um, I'm trying to finish up one of the ones from ColourPop before I start the black one that's in this project from Cargo and the black one from Clinique. We'll see how we do. I may have to just go ahead and start them and call a spade a spade. Next, we have the Benefits What's Up. You can see where we were and the red line is where we are now. Um, this is on today, but I, if you saw my uh, Zodiac Painter project update, you saw me do a whole face and I put this, I put this down on my hand and then I bring in Seismic or something else and mix them together because this is just, this is just too deep to be um, on my face without something mixed in with it. So my goal is to finish this. We are making pretty good progress. Um, one that's not even on my list is this. This is the MAC Painterly Paint Pot. My goal is to finish this. I haven't really been tracking this with pictures or anything, but you you can see I've made a significant dip in this. I use this every time I put my eyeshadow on, and some days I end up putting on my eyeshadow three different times because I hate the first eye look or I mess it up and I take it off and put it back on. So this, this is a workhorse and it gets a workout, but I absolutely love it um, as an eye primer, and I don't set it. Next, we have the Becca Petal Lipstick. If you remember, I melted it down into a cream blush because it was also stinky and off. It doesn't smell like, it's kind of smells sweet, which is weird. Anyway, my goal is to finish this. I use this as a purple blush um, when I'm wearing like a cool tone look. Anytime you've seen me with purple eyeshadow that's cooler, 
um, I'm wearing this. It turned out to be a beautiful, a beautiful cream, <laughs> cream blush. So I really like it. It's really beautiful. And yeah, I would have worn this today, but I was going for something a bit more neutral. So I went with my MAC Glow Play blush. So my goal is to finish that. I have used that four more times since the last update for a total of 22 times. Next is this one. This stays lying down, but I wonder if I can see through it with like the flashlight or something. I don't know. If I can find a line of demarcation or something, I will mark it. This is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lip in Patina Shimmer. Did I say Patina Shimmer? Patina Shimmer. It is what is on my lips today. It is a sparkly, shiny liquid lip. <laughs> so uh, it's really pretty. I don't like the wand. Look how messy this is. And this still has the stopper in it. It's not making any windows. Well, there's a little bit of windowing. I don't know. Anyway, let me swatch this for you. It's really pretty. It's comfortable. Um, but it's not something I would buy. I'm pretty sure this is probably cute for BoxyCharm. Uh, anything else? Oh, yeah. The last but not least is my um, Pharmacy Honey Halo. I didn't weigh this or anything and I haven't tracked it, but you can see I'm making good progress. My goal is to finish it. This is my nighttime moisturizer. So we are, we are making progress. We are making moves. The only thing I haven't started yet is the Rare Beauty um, concealer that I plan on using as a cream bronzer because I'm working on something in another project that ends sooner. Um, I haven't started the um, red lip <laughs> or the other lip that's in this project. Um, I have another Honeymoon Glow and, a, and this is the Honey Halo that I'm working on. So yeah, we still have a few more projects to get started. Um, I may bring in something else next month. Um, Courtney was so sweet and kind and gifted me this Hourglass palette for my birthday. And she also sent me a couple Hourglass lipsticks. And I, I think I wanna get some use out of these, but I'm not gonna bring this in just yet. I haven't decided if this is gonna go into this project or if it's gonna go into Get Baked because these are baked, um, a baked formula. So really, really pretty. So yeah, I mean, really, really pretty. So hope I can get some good use use out of that, but that's it. <laughs> that's it. So my goal for next time is hopefully to have that benefit um, highlighter finished, maybe have the liquid lip uh, make some more progress. I'd like to hit real pan in that Becca, uh, because that was just me sticking my fingernail in it to see how deep it was. <laughs> it's like, how deep does this really go? I want that cargo eyeliner finished because I am tired a bit. So I think that's it. I think that's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate you. Make sure you let me know in the comments how you are doing if you are doing this. It's not too late to hop on the train. If you want to, you can sign up by following the link in the description box down below. Post it on Instagram. Make sure you tag me. Use the hashtag so I can find you. Uh, I try to comment on everybody's videos. So if you've done this and I have missed your video, please let me know so I can come say hello. Uh, is there anything else I need to tell you? No, I don't think so. If you're interested in this eye look, this was a panner bingo in our palette bingo in my Zodiac panner um, update that went up on the 21st, but that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate you. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Have a great day, night, weekend, wherever you are. Love your faces, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.